Did you just press stop recording? Because we're recording this whole time. Start recording, that's why everything's still going. I thought we were recording. We are. I meant beforehand. Mm. Oh, are, 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 you, are you ready? A little professionalism here? Maybe if you were paying attention, you would notice this kind of stuff? It's ADD, not R E T A R D E D, okay? What? Good morning, good evening, or good afternoon, and thank you once again for joining us, the Modernsters of Gaming. I'm Kaiju K, and with us is Necro Short Bus Nick. Say hello, Necro. Yeah, I'm on the short bus. Hi, guys. Also with us today is the slap happy Reaper herself, <laughs> Reaper Rose. Say hello, Reaper. Hello. All right, everyone. So, we decided we were going to give The Sims a little bit of a break for a change, and, uh... <laughs> Do you scream into that pillow like that, too? Mm -hmm. I didn't want the coughing to be on the mic. That's fine. So what we have for you is a strange one this time. It's called Game Developer Tycoon, a game I personally really enjoyed. The uh, basic idea of the game is that uh, you start off with this little garage here, where you can obviously, that we need a flux capacitor to get the hell out of here, but staying ahead of time... That's right here, see? See, we need a flux capacitor. Yeah, it looks like the DeLorean. But uh, we basically make video games and uh, see how far they go. There's not a lot to this game. There's not a lot of visuals. So, you know, not a lot to worry about stressing out the computer. Unlike last time me and Reaper played Need for Speed and the computer kept slowing down. Yeah, that made it kind of difficult. Even though Necro had very negative things to say about our video. I'm sorry we were not the best drivers. We're noobs. That's why it says hashtag noob when you're looking for us. Hell, I even have it spelled wrong as N-E-W-B. Jerk. Hey, I'm part of this new category, but not a thing racing. That's right, Mr. Clean. So anyways, what we're going to do here, folks, is we're just going to... I got a little bit of hair up here, motherfucker. Easy there, man. Watch your language, Tiny. Hell no. So what we're going to do, folks, is we're going to take turns. Each one of us is going to make a video game and we'll see how we do. See if we can't uh, figure out what's going on. Now the thing is, this will go through all eras. It's going to start off with the Atari, which I think they call something like the the Asterix or something like that. And it's going to go up to the the the, the Pretendo or something like that. It, it's just different names for the new systems. And we got to try and figure out what games are going to play the best and which ones are going to fail. The highest rating I've ever gotten was like a, like an 80 or something like that. Like I've never gotten 100% on a game, never. That being said. Welcome to Game Dale Fell of Her Tycoon! In this business simulation, you have been tra transported back to the very start of the own video game development company, right at the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 35 years, trust me folks, it's not actually 35 years, you will, you can build your dream company, create the best selling games, gain fans, and become the leader of the market. But before you can start the adventure, we'll give you that upcoming company name. Company name. Let's call ourselves the Modernsters of Gaming! Oh, bloodiest of hells, I forgot to turn that off! Oh, no, Kyle's even a victim to it. Oh, jeez, deepest of apologies, folks. I did not mean to do that. I have to turn <laughs> my phone off right now. So Kyle no longer has this running gag with me. You're upset about phones. What are you talking about? I'm going to keep it going. You're a chick? Oh. Well, you can be a chick. If you're like... That's chicks. That's dudes. Okay. Um, yeah, I think that that'll be me. And uh, let's go with the let's go with the sweater vest, shall we? Yep. We're gonna call the first player Kaiju, and there will be many more. But before we can do this, folks, we're gonna have to take a brief pause while Necro here can talk to Reaper. I have to go and deliver something to somebody that I forgot to deliver to them. So I'll be right back. You guys have plenty of time to talk about whatever you want to talk about. Have fun. First thing that pops up. Oh, and don't forget, guys, I get to be the one who deals with the editing. So, hi, Reaper. Hi, Necro. How's it going? <laughs> it goes. I'm sick. I know. It's. I am a miserable POS right now. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I wish I could relax, but I can't. I have work. <laughs> Are you guys at least entertaining them? Um, well... No. Maybe. Why not? That's your jobs! I mean, they were listening to Reaper, so... I was bitching and moaning about life. Anyways. 
Let's continue. I'm sorry, I'm Miss Negative. Do we want hints? No. 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 Hell no, we don't want hints. So here we go. Develop a new game. Let's see, let's pick a topic here. Now at the beginning we only have four topics. Cyberpunk? I yes. say racing. Well, 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 you, okay, you'll be the first one to make a game then. So let's see if you fail or pass. So we're going to start with racing. Now the genre. What kind of racing games are going to be? Simulation. Racing simulation. Now we pick a platform. Do we want the G64 or the PC? Let's see. Dev cost? That's how much it's going to cost us just to develop for that system. I say PC. PC it is. It's cheaper. And what do you want to call your first ever racing game? Dodge. Dodge? Just Dodge. All right. Well, there better be a lot of Dodge cars in it. No, it I'm talking about Dodge, like getting around shit. Okay. Yeah. Is, is it going to be text based or are we going to have it graphic based? Graphic. 2D graphics. Well, it's a racing game. Well, you only get to do so much at the beginning, so. Okay, now comes the fun part. Ready? What? This is how you've got to set it up. Do you want it to have a lot of gameplay? Do you have to have a lot of power to the engine? Or do you have a, like to have a lot of stories and quests to it? It's a simple game, so gameplay. Lots of gameplay? You're saying little of these and little of those? Yep. A story and quests, I mean, it's a racing game, and it's back in the day. All right. How's that look to you? All right. Okay, so what's happening up here is these little thought bubbles are going to... Helping us out. Oh, that's a bug. <coughs> Bugs are bad. Okay, now for stage two. Want to have di more into dialogues, level design, or artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence and level design need to be higher. Okay, and dialogues? Stay there or go up, go down? Go down. How far? Not that far, because you want some announcers. Okay. Part two. Yeah, you got another bug. But we can we can get rid of the bugs. That's the best oh, part. Yeah. Okay, finally, last part of Dodge Racing Simulation: World design, graphics, or sound? Graphics. Up. Sound. Keep it. World design. Lower it. Okay, and we have 2D graphics, and we have basic sound. That's fine. Okay. So here comes here it goes. We're in the la the last stages of it. Ooh, lots of, ooh, geez, going nuts there. So well, what do we do about the bugs? Well, if we wait long enough, he'll actually get rid of them like he just did. Yes. So now we're finishing it up. So this is how much experience we gained for a new topic and a new combo. As so we actually level up these skills, so. Alrighty, so we're going to release Dodge. Everybody ready? Nope. Yep. It has been released. The first reviews of our newly released game, Dodge, came in. Is everybody ready? Yep. Let's see how Reaper did. Alright, so... Simulations work well on PC from Star Games 7. Could have been better, informed gamer. I hate informed gamer. Yeah, that was just Enjoyable game hero. They're the guys I like. Beautiful, all games. All right, three sevens and a six. Nice score. If one game so sucks, so you're probably gonna get a low score from them anyway. Uh, just released their first game, Dodge. The game received favorable reviews with such a good start. Modernsters of gaming are sure to gain fans quickly. <laughs> now, now, now we get to see how it does. So this is how well it's selling. It sell, sold 4,622 units in the first week and was number 41. <laughs> Remember, that's out of 100, so she at least made it to the list. Nice going, Reaper! Dodge was so successful that we now have 21 fans! Hey, that's Reaper. more fans than we currently have on our YouTube page! Oh my god. Woo! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, oh, and sold a decent amount the second week. I think it sold almost the same amount. The company's sales record over 10,000 units sold nice. with only one game. Nice. You it took me and Necro like two or three games to reach this last time. I 
actually you create the first game which bomb and then I create one and it, like it, it, we contradict each other because you bomb and I would do good and then you would do <laughs> then I would do good and you would bomb so we're going by <clears throat> one week or what uh, it's by yeah. month actually this is week three of month five so we're just we have to wait for how long to do another oh, game? Oh, we can do again. We can research. We can do all kinds of things. I was thinking of researching a new topic in gaming. I'm going to research space. Then I'm going to go and... Oh, now we have to wait. Yep. Me and, me and Necro like to wait until after the game's done selling before we start the new game. Oh, Just okay. so you know, you ha how dodged off the market. It sold sixteen thousand six hundred and ten units, generating a hundred and sixteen thousand three hundred and four dollars. Wow, that is a load of uh, money right there. Thank and you. That's thank you. That's why we like to wait it off just, just to so see how much we have to spend on the next game. All right, so time to develop a new game. Neko, do you want to pick this one? Hey, you already picked space, so you're gonna do this game. Okay, I was just picking space because that seems to be one of the best ones to pick. I'm gonna make it space. I'm gonna make an action space game, and we're gonna stick. I'm gonna stick with the PC. It's cheaper to make. Yep, and I'm gonna call this one. Um. Uh, space dust. Next up, it's gonna be 2D graphics. Okay, for this game, I'm going to need tons of engine. I'm going to need tons of gameplay and just a little bit of storyline quests. It's not a role-playing game, so yeah, it's not an adventure. Oh, jeez, look at it fly. The, the good Vidor G64 is steadily outselling its competitors in the PC market. Consumers prefer the lower price and greater availability and flexible hardware. Well, you know what? We're sticking with PC, buddy. It might spell the end of competing hardware manufacturers. We'll find out, but for the moment, I'm sticking with PC. All right, level design, artificial intelligence, but I'm also gonna want some dialogues. I'm gonna want it to be, you know what? Let's max them all out. It's your game. It is indeed. Look at all those points. Look at all that research. Now for this one, I'm gonna want it to be just as well graphic, but I want great world design. I want people to feel like they're actually in space, even though it's, you know, basically Atari graphics. Hey, you never know. Finish. Not yet. Not yet. Yes, folks, by the way, we will be waiting for every one of the bugs to finish. And occasionally we get extra points. Yeah, and at but... the end, occasionally you get, like, one extra point. New record! Well, not by much. All right. All right. We're not going to get nice. any level ups here, but it's nice to know that we're getting close. Yeah. Necro might be able to level one or two of them up. Alright, let's release Space Dust. God, so what do you think? Will Cal be a bomb or a success? We'll see. Ooh, stop making me nervous, you bastards. Uh, 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 good game, Star Games. Alright, so far starting off good. Beautiful, informed gamer, starting off good. Still there, still there. Enjoyable, no. still good, game hero. Come on, one more seven. Damn oh, you, all games. games. Freaking tied. Could have been better. You, all games. The last game could have been better, too. You suck, all games. No, informed games is the one. Oh, here you go. According, according to rumors, the Japanese company Ninvento is planning to launch its very own game console, the Ninvento. It's known for a widely successful arcade game, Dinky, Dinky King. I wow. wonder what that could possibly be an homage to. Wow. Many industries experts doubt the home gaming console will, t will take off, but we are eager to see what Ninvento will deliver. We well, know how that goes. Yeah, we know how that goes. Unfortunately, it turns out horrible in the end. Yes. You heard us, Ninvento. All right, let's see my sales. Come on. Push me up there. Uh, come on. Come on! Keep going! Oh. You're not selling as good as no, Reaper. No, I'm, I'm only rank 50. I'm only rank 50. She's, Reaper! Reaper still crushes oh. me. Oh. Reaper crushed me. Boom, boom, firepower. 
Okay, well, let's do some research. Okay, so research. Let's generate game reports. Oh, that just tells us how our company's doing. Oh. So you want to do a new, to new topic? <coughs> yeah. Okay, these are your topics. Aliens, business, hacking, or ninja? Gang, go with ninja. Ninja it is. He's going to start the research on ninja. Now I'm only rank 75. Now I'm only rank 84. Game three fans. Woo! It, it, we're almost... To, oh, look, I actually sold better in the last quarter than I did the last month. Okay, today Nintendo has confirmed recent rumors and announced their plans to release the new home, you know, new gaming console known as the TES. Wow. I think I think we go and purchase that one, don't we, Nick? Yeah, we're gonna go purchase that one. Okay, so here we go, guys. Let's develop one more game. Pick a topic, Nick. Yeah, go with Ninja. Ninja. Pick a genre. I'm a ninja. I'm, I'm going to go with strategy. That's fine. You can keep dancing around all you want. Pick a platform. Oh, we can't pick them yet. PC uh, or G64? You know what? I'm going to throw it to the 64. <gasps> Heathen! Can I go throw it to the 64? This is what made an Invento fail. Making freaking jumps like that, you fail. What are you going to call your ninja strategy game for the G64? <laughs> no pressure. <laughs> uh, well, um, um, Clash um, of the Nipples. <laughs> sure. No. Why not? No. It's for the G64, man. This is before adult games came out. Come on. Uh, Save that for the Xbox. <laughs> or Dude, I played Leisure Shoot Larry. We'll call it Blindfold. 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 Mm. blindfold or blindfolded? Fold. Blindfold. Blindfold, the ninja strategy game for the G64. Text-based or 2D graphics? 2D. I think the only... I don't know if text-based would actually sell really well. Okay. How do you want this to run? Engine, gameplay, storyline, quest. Come on, man. Pick it. Um, let's drop uh, both engine and gameplay down to, like, half and toss those stories all the way up. Okay, maxing out storyline and quest. All right. Space Dust is now off the market. It sold 17,139 units. And How many units did I sell? I sold better. Look at the price. 1,019, not 1,013. Uh. So I just barely beat you there. But you still have the better score. Mm -hmm. 50, 43 versus 50. You win. Mm -hmm. I, I couldn't top the charts like you could. I didn't top the charts. Well, I mean, so far you did. We're, we're, we're talking about each other, okay. Dialogue, level design, or artificial intelligence? Uh, drop artificial down and keep the other ones up. Okay. Well, I guess if they're blindfolded ninjas, they don't need much intelligence, you know? Right. No! Oh, what the heck? <laughs> you ran into a tree, Bob! The trees! They're supposed to be ninjas. They should know how to navigate in the dark. So they should be able to do it blindfolded. Maybe that's the whole idea. World design, graphics, or sound? How do you want it? That looks good. Yeah. Okay, let's see here. Oh, well, tons of research. We need 50 points in research, though. Gotta wait for the bugs, folks. Come on. There we go. I got a couple of things to design in there for us. Well, he didn't get a, new, a better score than we did. And we're real close to leveling up a lot of skills. I say that I'll probably be the first person to have any of the level up skills. Yeah, I mean, you're probably going to level up almost everything. Release, Release the game. game! Release the game! Blindfold, go! For the first reviews for the new game, Blindfold came in. Oh, fuck. Strategy games work well on the G64. Uninspiring! Wow. <laughs> Disappointing! Wow, Nick. <laughs> Waste of time! Oh! oh burn! <laughs> yeah. Um, Just remember, guys, you all created a bad game one. Oh, uh, we know, we know. So far, you've created the worst one, though. Okay, so. You, okay, Reaper, time for your new topic. You don't have to make a game out of this, you just have to pick a topic. Aliens. Aliens. Aliens is always a good one. 
Let's watch how well Necro does. 100,000 copies, not too bad. Oh, today the new game platform TES by Ninvento has been released. Hi there, I just finished Blindfold and I think you have some potential. I'm in the contracting business, we could use your skills like yours. If you're ever short on cash, just let me know and I will see how if you have some work. Jason. Or he? Yes. Okay, new topic of aliens. But folks, we're going to have to leave you here for a brief moment because our time is up. So, when we get back, Reaper Rose will be bringing out a new game on the Ninvento. Ninvento! As always... Bang, bang! Oh, I'm... I should have done hunting. Maybe you should have. Maybe, you'll... Maybe that'll be your next one. As always, I'm Kaiju K. Oh, I'm Nick. Reaper Rose. I'm Necro Nick. Oh! Almost and... in the balls. Oh, and we'll see you guys later. Peace out. Have Peace. a good one. Oh! <laughs> You okay? Oh.